Welcome to the Creating a Groove tutorial. And Digital Performer has a variety of grooves already included in the actual platform itself. However, what I want to do is I want to save this groove that I've created in this drum track here. It's very easy to do. Let's first listen to that. Okay. And just to explain what a groove is to anybody who doesn't really know, I'm sure you've heard that's groovy, I'm sure you've heard that's a hip sound, all these different idioms to express what the sound is in terms of its musical vitality, okay? Well, the groove basically is when there's a kind of flow in the rhythm and, for example, one element of the rhythm could be before or after or it could be slowed down a little bit. It's not mathematically precise, but it has feel to it, okay? We've highlighted this region, okay? And what we're going to do... Okay. Is first create a groove. Okay. And we're going to call this cool. Okay. And now we have that as the groove that this is naturally. Okay. So now we can close that. We've created that groove. We'll shave, we'll save it. Now go here and go to Groove Quantize. So you'll see that that groove that we've created already exists now, okay? But I'm going to try this groove out. And compare it to what we had before. Right? Change this one, see? Look at how the data is changing, right? there in the highlighted region every time I change the groove. Original. And just play around with these variables here. See which sounds better. I mean, that's really the essence of it, okay? The algorithm is fantastic. You can add to it. And let's just say you like what you did initially and you want to use it in another session. Well, Digital Performer will analyze your groove and you can put it anywhere. And this concludes the tutorial on creating a groove.